Uh, Javon was a big play in the game for you guys. Um, I really think my team needed to play, and um, we needed something to go fast, uh, so uh, to bring some energy to our sideline, and I was able to make a play and uh, to spark the team. And then you see our kill Newsom just go crazy from the rest. So I mean, it's a phenomenal feeling. They marched the ball in that first series, and again, it's become a trademark of this team. You held them on first and goal at the four and helped them to a field goal. How important was that to kind of swing momentum right on, right at the start? I mean, it's always important getting off the field and holding teams to field goals, and uh, getting off the field most importantly. And uh, I mean, just uh, that's just the way we play defense. B B I A best in America. Run to the ball. Hold. To keep keep the points down. And play hard, and that's just that's the way we play defense, and that's how we do things at UConn. Jamar gets an interception. Obi gets an interception. Yeah. And you get another fumble recovery. Three turnovers last week. You get four this week, and the defense is really starting to get this mentality of being a, a ball hawking defense. I mean, we just worked. We worked our behind off all all season and all preseason camp, and we just know uh, we just know it's gonna pay off. And now it's finally starting to pay off, and uh, it's a phenomenal feeling knowing that hard work pays off. You were on the team two years ago that came down here and got worked pretty good. Is it a nice feeling to kind of hand it back to them? Oh yes, man. It feels so much better. I mean, being uh, one and zero in our side of the division of the conference, it's just a phenomenal feeling. And then next, now we gotta take care of business. We got USF at homecoming. Um, I'm just excited. How many people did you have?